Hi guys, welcome back to the Rhinestone Realtor. So we've done a few real estate videos today, but I'm gonna do something totally not real estate related at all because you know what? There's more to life than real estate. <gasps> Don't tell anybody who said that. So we're gonna do a what's in my purse video. And I have a never full GM. Can y'all see it? There we go. So I've had this thing for probably three or four years now. And it is the best purse I've had, like, ever. The only thing I wish is, like, the straps weren't so thin. Because I stuffed this thing to the max. Because not only is it a purse, but I also use it for all my real estate things. So, like, carrying lock boxes and documents, file folders, laptops, that kind of thing. So, it can get kind of heavy after a while. So, if you have any suggestions on a purse that's similar to this baby, um but with thicker straps, definitely let me know in the comments down below. Um, so I am going to go through because it's time to clean this out. So I figured, hey, we'll do a video. Um, but I have the one that's the Rose Ballerine. So it's got like that pale pink in there. Um, I thought it was a little extra bonus and whatnot. And I actually got this off of Tradesy. So it was really nice to get a little discount on it because it was maybe like six months old. Uh, when I got it but since I carry so much stuff in there hopefully y'all can tell um, I use one of those Samorga organizers um, I'll put a link down in the description box below but basically it's a felt organizer that has like all different little pockets and stuff so you don't have to have all the different zipper bags and like start fumbling around and, um, in your purse trying to find stuff so let's get started I'm a little nervous. What if I have something bad in there? I probably won't, but um, So the first thing I have is business cards um, So I have different ones because I do both property management and am a broker. So I've got my broker ones here So these little black ones Hopefully you can see got a little gold metallic on it and then I've got my property manager one as well and So we've got that. Where am I supposed to put this stuff? Mm -hmm. Bring my desk a little closer to us. It's on wheels, so it's pretty cool. Um, let's see, we've got Mario Badescu face misting spray. So if I'm out and about at like houses that are nasty because I do a lot of foreclosures, I'll just spritz that and makes it feel a little nice and fresh after walking through a nasty house. Oh, we need to close the lid on that. Um, so I get massages every once in a while. So this is leftover massage lotion and looks like I got a, <laughs> a lot of lotions in here um so I got those L'Occitane like advent calendars for Christmas and I might have like four in here so I've got the cherry blossom one right here in like a little mini size hopefully y'all can read that and then I've got the almond one which this one smells really good if I don't want anything like floral so I've got those uh, then we've got some more sunglasses that don't have rhinestones, so I feel like I'm kind of cheating, but we've got those. And of course, I don't pay big bucks for um, sunglasses because I lose them all the time, so why do that? We've got a comb, so when I'm out showing lots and stuff and it gets windy, I can make my hair a little bit more presentable. Another pair of sunglasses. These are little cheapos from Target, I think. Got a little cheetah print on it. It's a little different. I like those because they hold my hair back really well when I'm out showing lots and stuff. Oh look, another lotion. And then, okay, so I might have a Bath and Body Works obsession. So I've got two of the little pocket backs, little limoncello one, and Magic in the Air one. So I like to use those after showing the foreclosure. Or if I'm doing an open house and have a lot of people coming through, um, shaking hands with people, it gets kind of nasty. So, nice and germ-free, hopefully. Then we've got baby wipes in the in case I need to wipe stuff down while I'm out of the house. Got my little coin purse. Let's see if it has anything in there. Like three coins. Don't tell Dave Ramsey. Then I've got loose cash. And... Another lotion and a receipt from Whataburger. What'd I get? <clears throat> Diet Coke. Shocker. 
What else do we have in here? So we have my Realtor badge. So my broker got me the little rhinestone one. As you know, I'm a little extra like that. And another receipt. Okay. Good thing I'm cleaning this thing out. It's felt so heavy lately, it's ridiculous. So <laughs> we've got pin from a law seminar. I do property management as well so I did like a little landlord tenant law weekend thing it was pretty good then we've got deodorant and my keys oh what just dropped and I hear tight so I've got like all different types of keys for like my rentals my house my garage my car my super key to show houses my townhouse all kinds of stuff. This I got from Glitzy Glam. Can you tell it's kind of old? Oh, here you go. Yeah, I've used that for sure, but that's definitely easy to like carry it around, put it on the wrist, so when I'm opening up houses and whatnot, I don't drop my keys. It's kind of great because I've dropped a hell of a lot of, ooh, bad word, a lot of phones when I'm opening up houses. Another receipt. Everything's like underneath the organizer. I don't know what I did. Okay, so we have another set of keys. So I'm the cookbook chair for Junior League. And so I have a key to the storage unit with all the cookbooks because we got to sell them and replenish all the time. We got batteries, another rhinestone badge, and another badge. <laughs> Can you tell I do a lot of stuff? And then some cash. And then like one of those little headphone converter things. So I was in London on a vacation and I just could not figure out how to use my headphones. It turns out they were the wrong kind. So I had to go buy a converter in the Heathrow airport. So that was fun. Got more cash. High roller, huh? And then let's see, let's go in this pocket. Oh, I've got a Dave Ramsey book. So like if I'm like in between showings and have like a few minutes, I'll just pop this out. This is the legacy journey. I'm probably like a chapter or two in, but now that I am debt free, so go and check that uh, video out on my channel. Uh, thinking about the future. Doo, 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 doo. Okay, I have a lotion problem, I guess. Cause we've got another L'Occitane one. It's the roses one. And then we've got more batteries and some eyeliner. I use the NYC one. I've used it since like high school and it is the best liquid liner ever. Super easy, super cheap. I like it. And then I've got Benefits Their Real Mascara. So I buy these, um, Black Friday every year and so instead of paying $23 I get them for $15 and I get little mini versions of like the bronzer and highlighter and stuff. So I get four so that I can change it out every quarter. Don't have to worry about it. Then we got another lotion and like one of these little hair ties so you don't get those little crimps. I've totally been looking for this because I've had I've had crimpy hair for a long time and I don't like it. So I love using those for the gym. That way I can get on the lip to cool and just keep on going. Now I've got this little perfume atomizer. I have no idea what perfume's in it. Let's try. That's Prada candy. It is my best. Get, get you some. <laughs> we haven't done this one yet. So this comes from my little wires pocket. So we've got headphones. We've got one of those earbuds. Do you know? be one of those people who talks with the little thing in their ear. So it's really good if I'm like doing a long haul drive and they don't make some phone calls and ret returns and whatnot. I just stick that in and talk while I go. So that way you don't have all that road noise because that's so annoying. Then I've got Plexus Slim packets. So if you haven't tried those, they're awesome. Um, they used to be like beet juice or something. I don't know, but they're yummy if you, don't, if you want some flavor in your water. Okay, so that's half of the packets. We got some more stuff. So we've got tweezers, cause you get the best lighting outside. And if you're in your car, you're outside. And so you could just do a little doo 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 doo. 
keeping it all nice and fresh. And then I've got this little chapstick from my sister's bachelorette party, kissing the single life goodbye. Well, she was, I wasn't. <laughs> Good chapstick though. I think it's like cherry chapstick. And then, oh, more hand sanitizer. And it's the kind with glitter. Can y'all see that? Yeah, I hate this stuff because it gets glitter on me all the time, but who cares? I still like it, it smells good. So we're gonna use it up and just not repurchase. Then we've got these little crisp white strip things. I don't know why I have those. Oh, I've got so much stuff to clean out, this is crazy. Then we've got a perfume from La Vanilla. I think this is the grapefruit one. Yeah, I think it's grapefruit. But I have not seen these in store in forever. And I was at TJ Maxx and they had like 10 of them. So I bought all 10. So they have like vanilla grapefruit, vanilla coconut, and vanilla lemon, I think it is. So I got all of them. And then we've got a little coach sampler thing. So I get those like little samplers at Christmas every year. And then I use the little gift card to get me a like real size sample. So, that's probably what that's from. We got paper. So, if you can't tell, I like getting the Diet Coke at Whataburger. And then we've got grocery from Aldi. Then we've got a to-do list. What's on there? Taxes. Um, another Whataburger one. And then a little letter from Junior Lee, because I, I wanted to spotlight one of my ladies on my committee. She did awesome and she wasn't there, so I've gotta take that to her. Hopefully I don't forget. I think I'm seeing her this weekend though. So, then we got, ooh, that was a fun one. Receipt from post office when I bought stamps to send off three day notices for tenants who didn't pay. We're taking this thing out. Okay, so this is empty other than like some coins in there. So we'll get to that later. We're almost done, guys. It's gonna be scary to undo. We got the new Plexus Slim. This one's like the hunger control. I don't really like it. I like the original one, but I still buy it because it, it feels good. And then the last thing in here, other than like some coins and hair ties, I need to clean that thing. I dropped chocolate there. That was sad. So I have the Kate Spade like planner thing. And this is one of those Dave Ramsey things where I like to turn planner into a, <laughs> into a wallet. Um, yeah, so I've got like all my different thingies here and whatnot. So I'll go through that in a different video, but this is what I use for my wallet. So hopefully you guys enjoy going through my trashy unorganized purse. Hopefully it'll be clean and stay clean for a while. See you later.